This is the Morning Swim Show Streamline for Thursday, April 15th, 2010, bringing you news from aquatic sports around the globe. The fast swimming at the French Nationals continues, even in prelims. One of the meet's quirky policies is that all French swimmers must swim faster than a certain time in prelims just to be considered for selection to the European Championships. Then they have to swim under an even faster time in semis and finals. This is to ensure that French swimmers understand the importance of going fast in prelims. And Elaine Bernard did just that in the 100 freestyle, posting a 48.92 prelim swim, then followed that up with a 48.32 in the semis, the fastest swim of the year so far, bumping Eamon Sullivan to second place. And one day after swimming the fastest 50 free of the year, Fred Bousquet likely coasted through the prelims of the 100 free, swam a 50.36 that got him 10th place, but then he did wake up big time and posted a 49.41 to put himself into the final. But again, under French policy, it appears that no matter how fast Bousquet swims in the final, he won't be able to swim that individual 100 free at the European Championships based on his slow prelim swim. Doesn't seem like a very smart rule. We'll see if they hold to it. Well, Bousquet's teammate, Fabian Gillot, swam a 48.62 in the semis. That was the fourth fastest time of the year so far. Camille Mafad had the other great swim in Saint Raphael with her 2.10.94 in the women's 200 IM semis. It's the fourth fastest time of the year behind Stephanie Rice, Ariana Kukers, and Emily Seabom. Over in Japan, Kazuke Kitajima found himself in unfamiliar territory fourth place. The four-time Olympic champ couldn't beat his younger rivals in the final of the 200 breaststroke at the Japanese Nationals. Kitajima went 2-12-53 well behind Ryo Tatishi, who's become the next face of Japanese breaststroke. Tatishi swam a 2:09:21, making him the fastest swimmer in the event this year, just one-tenth behind Brenton Ricard. Tatishi and Kitajima will face off Saturday in the 100 breast. And Takura Fuji and Masuyaki Kishida, they'll do battle tomorrow in the 100 fly final. Fuji was a finalist in the 100 fly in Beijing and helped Japan with a bronze medal in the 400 medley. Kishida won the 50 free yesterday. It's obviously having a great meet so far. Okay, their times in the semis. Fuji went 51.99. Kishida just behind him at 52.19. And Aya Terakawa became the fourth woman under the one-minute barrier in the 100 back so far this year. She won the final in Tokyo today with a 59-72. Three other swimmers in the final were just a few tenths away from joining her under that minute mark. And Ko Junya Koga, the world champ in the 100 back, just touched out Rosuki Irie in the men's 100 back with a 53-49. Irie just behind at 53-61. Roland Schumann, he won the 100 free final in Durban, South Africa today with a 49.51. Schumann had a challenge from a couple of countrymen now training in the U.S. Gideon Lowe, a senior at Auburn, got second at 49.62. And Cal Jr. Graham Moore was third at 49.99. Darian Townsend was fourth at the 50 flat. We got recaps from all these meets today on our website, swimmingworld.com. And that's the news for today. I'm Peter Bush reminding you to... Keep your head down at the finish.